Well, Matthews Help Center is a local nonprofit that for more than four decades has been helping people get through a financial crisis. And with just days until Christmas, they were all hands on deck trying to help out some families in the area. Larry Sprinkle caught up with some of their staff as they took over the Matthews Town Hall for a great cause. Anything that we can do to kind of help lighten the burden of their financial situation and bring them joy. For Christmas this year, Matthews Help Center and the Matthews Police Department teamed up to collect toys, games, bikes, skateboards, dolls, gift cards, and more for those challenged families. It's a community effort. It's the Matthews Police Department, the town of Matthews. There's churches, businesses, organizations, um, individual donors all make this happen every single year. We knew that Matthews Help Center had already been doing this for 30 years, so we decided to partner with them and combine our resources so we can reach even more families. Over 100 families actually had the chance to shop for their children for the holidays. Christmas is a very busy time of the year. I have two birthdays in Christmas <laughs> plus Christmas, so this does take the burden off of having to get all of the Christmas gifts that we you know, would like to get for our babies, we just simply can't afford to get for our babies. Sandra Conway is the executive director of the Matthews Help Center. She said the community once again has been incredibly supportive. Anytime that we can say we love our community and the way that we can love on one another is by helping one another. Christmas is a time for giving and people gave and gave more this year with a lot of love in their hearts. I got scooters, we got a beautiful bicycle, we have a um, stand-on keyboard, it's a little from FAO Schwartz, we got Barbie doll and Legos and Nerf guns and it was just a blast. In Matthews, Larry Sprinkle, back to you.